You're muted, you amateur. Listen, I am in mourning. I am in mourning. I'm sorry, I know. I'm seeing all, all the real ones just drop off like flies here. And I, you know, have come to the very difficult decision that I will be self-deleting um, delete laws in conjunction with Turtle Boy Sports and Laguna Lauren. Um, I can't, I just can't beat it. Kate always loses. Um, I'm done. I'm going to write a note. I'm going to name them all specifically on my note for the reason that I'm deleting myself from this mortal plane. I just, what happened? Well, you know, essentially, Chili has come out swinging, um, very formidable. He has a very good grasp on very personal details of his enemies' lives. Um, he's getting all of the details entirely correct. He's not fabricating anything on anyone, uh, which has just got me shaking in my boots because his, his superior intellect um, and ability to, you know, grasp what he's being told. Um, he's also, you, you know, he's going to sue everybody. He he served James Freeman last night uh, publicly, you know, not like dance battle served, but like, you know, put him on public notice. So pretty much it, like it's it's over for us. We, we, we tried so hard. We got so far in the end. It didn't even matter because yeah. Chili DeCastro is coming for us all. You had to fall to lose it all, Kate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had to fall to lose it all. Um, and we did fall. We did. Oh, how the mediocre have fallen. Really? Not even tech. <laughs> the mediocre. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's just like, you know, like, how are we going to beat this guy? He literally, did you see? He announced to James Freeman that he was being sued. And, and just like that, you know, he's, he's being sued. No, I know, you know, after COVID, now you can just think about lawsuits and they get filed. Yeah. Pretty much, guys, like this is this is how it's gonna go. It's been real. I love you all uh forever, my heart, you know. But uh your new overlords are Chili De Castro and Turtle Boy Sports. Um, I hope that you like pledging fealty because you're going to have to give them your blind loyalty immediately. I'm just passing the mantle over. Um, love I'm not sure for, only. Yeah, yeah. He's going to get us court ordered off the internet, so it's only a matter of time anyway. Does he fill that out in crayon? I, I probably, probably. I want to know a court ruling over hurt feelings where the judge was like, you are banned from social media, sir. Yes. Uh, it's a, it's a boomer. Um, thank you. You should have, it is not a boomer says I probably should have warned you. I knew the Pamela Anderson of the gays would trounce you. Yeah. If somebody could have warned me, that would have been nice because here I am just <clears throat> stuck here with the proverbial pants around my ankles, gunt flapping everywhere. Just really, you know, <laughs> off in the wind. This is it. This is the end for us. How will you we should make me survive? choke on my drink, your guns. <laughs> right. That's what happened. That's what happened. What was the final straw here? You know, the proverbial, bleh, proverbial last nail in the coffin for you, Kate. The, 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 the straw on the camel's back, so to speak. Um, sure. You know, Let's use for that me, one. it was when he called James Freeman a dunce cap for the 450th time 449 i was like maybe we can hold out 450th i was like this is it we can't we can't prevail uh he called me a scumbag again it really hurt my feelings a lot because chili is someone that i look up to a lot just knowing that he's colluding and friends with laguna lauren and i can't sit at their cool kids table breaks my my heart um you know, they probably don't have enough space for, I mean, actually, they probably do have enough space because they're all really thin, attractive, successful people. So there probably is a spot for me there. There's not a lot of space taken up at that table. But you're not welcome. Small people, but I'm not welcome, right? Like I got, I got voted off the island. And then of course, you know, uh, when Aiden was going behind the scenes, Turtle Boy Sports, uh, convincing people to, you know, go after my family members because he doesn't really care about me at all and never thinks about me and only dedicates probably about, you know, 90 minutes a week to talking about me uh, openly on the air. Uh, it made me realize that I'm really insignificant and I'm small and they beat me and it's done. It does. Yes. Thank you, Fizzy. It does. It sucks when your own mentally disabled brother turns on you like Chili has done to me. It's very hurtful. Very, very hurtful. Yeah, well, I, where do we go from here? Where do we, there's nowhere to go from here, except, you know, six feet under in the ground. Oh, you're done, Kate Peter. Yeah, I mean, he did a lengthy video. Um, 
you know, he did a lengthy video. I think we could probably share it and play it and like listen to it and really listen to his words and listen to how serious he is and uh, how we're all fucked, you know? Off, And I'm going to try to do the same thing every time. Make sure everybody hit your like button, take your like button and push it. That's what gets more people in the room. And right now, drop in the comment section. I don't care if you're watching in a three weeks or four weeks or in a month. Write down right here where you're watching from. What state, what city, wherever you want to be. America, Australia, Japan, New Zealand. Just type right down in there where you guys are watching from. Sorry, I took so long. Um, I was getting ready. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be, uh, I'll be driving today. So I'll be on a long, long, I'll be on a long, long drive. Um, you know, I unblocked uh, the trolls. Look, trolls, you guys are welcome to come in and say what you want. Good to see you. Nipples. The guy's name is Nipples. What's going on, Sweden? How's everybody doing? Good to see everybody. Uh, thank you for the super chat, Todd. God bless you. Lily Rose. What's going on, Lily Rose? Um, you know, so um, what I'm going to do, guys, is um, you can you can have all. Oh, let me let me. So Lauren obviously will not time anybody out. Uh, rumble. Look, let me just explain what happened. Um, we had a rogue moderator. Um, Bob, if you want to stay on topic, that's fine. If not, I'll kick you out, dude. So I'll put you in timeout for now, Bobby. Um, you know, but uh, if, you, if you start to call me names and be a dick, I'll just block you from the channel permanently, dude. I'll be checking the block list every single time. Moderators, please don't block anybody. If they're a major asshole, if Bob is a major asshole, by a second or third personal attack, I'll just block him permanently from my from my feed. And I'm keeping track now. But don't block I'm anybody. really tuned in. Let me fix my hair here. I haven't even, I, I didn't even get myself ready. I just cleaned myself up a little bit and jumped on this live. So what's going on? Beth Rist is in the house. Caddy, Daddy, Citizens Broadcast Cooperative. Gloria's in the room. Everybody, do me a favor, hit the like button. There's 120 people here. What's up, Playboy? What's up, Playboy? What's up? Oh, that's so sweet of you, Bow. Um, what's uh, Tabitha, Bruce? Um, good to see you. Um, uh, you know, do me a favor and, and uh, just, you guys try to be decent. You know, look, um, so I'm going to do a few things over this next week that are pretty much going to shock you guys because I'm going to uh, go into this madness. Pamela Knox is in the hizzy. How you doing, Pamela? Um, I removed all the moderators yesterday, um, and uh, I added a few back today, people who have been with me for a while. Um, but just so you guys know, uh, you know, I had a rogue moderator who blocked a bunch of supporters. So I'm going to go through and check the block list every day. Don't block anybody or I'll remove you as a moderator. Let me do the blocking, and I will block people 100%. 100% I will block people. There are people who are assholes like this woman who goes by love. I'm not going to give you the rest of her account, but she's a total asshole and I really don't have to put up with her. You know, she didn't build up a following. I did. So, you know, this is what I'm doing with my life and, and I, I don't want to block people. I want to hear the opposing view. I don't want an echo chamber, but at the same time, you know, you can't come here and just be a dick. Is it fair enough? If not, that's fine. I actually sent off a, an email today to somebody who hates my guts. This guy hates my guts, hates, hates, hates my guts. And um, I've seen all the things he said about me. I sent him an email today and said, I'll do an interview with you. I'll do a talk with you, not an interview, because I'm going to ask him questions too. If he agrees to do it, because he contacted me already, said, hey, come on my channel. I'll give you a fair chance and um, we'll see about that. I did send him an email today and I, I said to him, look, more than willing to have a conversation with you. Because, you know, I also want to address this, um, you know, I've been in front of the camera for a year now. I've been public for a year. I've been a public personality for a year, even though I don't think that I'm a, um, officially a public person as far as the law is concerned. And so, um, you know, there you go. Alan won't block anybody, but I added him as a moderator because I don't want him blocked. And someone had, Alan Hubs it has been a friend of mine since the beginning of this year and he was on the block list. So was, uh, there was, I, I don't want to say any names because then people will target these people, you know? Um, I don't want to block people. I want to have conversations with people, you know, and I want to have, uh, everybody hit the like button. There's only 60 likes. We do not have a hundred trolls in here. So I'm going to wait a second while everybody stops what you're doing. Dude, I love Jock Sock. Actually, Jock Sock was a great company, dude. It was a tanning company. I'd go to tanning conventions and there was all these beautiful girls, all spray tanned golden. Uh, 
Yeah, that's how you guys know that I don't really have any victims because I've dated more than two girls in my life. So you would hear from them quickly. If more I was than two of his age? Good it would, for him. It would happen very quickly. You know, as soon as a, a man, especially a, a uh, aggressive man, is, is a public uh, personality, then what happens is the any woman you've ever treated bad comes out and says, you're a horrible person. But as you guys have seen in the past year, that has not happened. Uh, my girlfriend of seven years uh, did a recorded phone call with me and she said uh, she actually wanted her current boyfriend who she broke up with to not treat her the way he treated her when he got mad. So, you know, so I, I feel, I, you know, and then I feel pretty exonerated. Exo Charlie Little Bear, Charlie Little Bear. Charlie. The people are asking about you, Charlie. I mean, up until this boy, he really is just, he really is showing us. He really is showing us. Oh, where's the victims? He's dating right. more than two people. And they like him. They like him. <laughs> I love this seven years, seven year girlfriend. <laughs> oh, good. You're dressed. Well, You're dressed appropriately for this funeral. Thank you. Welcome. <laughs> Sorry, you doing proceed. All right? Yeah, no, no. Gonna be, yeah. Go ahead. What's proceed. the other side Sorry. like, Josh? Is this it okay is over there? I'm not wearing pants, um, it, which is great, but I, I couldn't make it to heaven. I'm in, I'm in fucking limbo. It turns out God, not a fan of auditors. So it's going to be a rough stay. I <laughs> uh, thought I was a dick. There's no complaint process here. It's, it's kind of fucked up. But Have you asked to speak to a supervisor? I did. Satan pretty much just burned me. It's, it's, okay. it's a rough blow. Well, but did I you tell him you're going to file a federal lawsuit? Um, you no, know, Bobby Laws, uh, well, I'm going to talk to Bobby Laws. He's already down here in hell with me. So I just got to go to his room. <laughs> this is painful. Don't laugh. Like, geez, like yeah, we're I, all, we're all, this is the end. This is the end. I wanted to emulate chili. So I popped my funeral collar. It's a new thing. It looks good. <laughs> looks good. It reduces your chins by at least three. Yeah. Well, <laughs> yeah, I, I can only see. The one now, I, I might unbutton soon, though. I need to do the same thing, but... Josh is going to actually suffocate on live stream. Say something good. Say something right. good. So you only have to be a subscriber um, to uh, Stiggs. I unblocked you. Uh, I, I, I remember you, Stiggs. I, I, I see all the screenshots of you on Troll Channel, Stiggs. I've read all the things you've said about me. Uh, you're welcome to say those things about me. I can see you, good old boy. I told you, good old boy, I did not block you. Um... Hey, Lauren, can you stay on topic? Would you do that for me? I'm, I'm doing what I'm doing in my room. If you could please stay on topic, that's the whole point. You are wrenched, Lauren, you are wrenched. But can you please stay on the topic that I'm talking about? Because this is the following that I've built up. This is what I'm doing with my life. You know, I know you want to do some things too. More than willing to promote you, more than willing to, to have you have a conversation with people. But can we just stay on the topic of of what I'm talking about. I mean, if that's okay, you know, I'd like to, I'd like to be able to, to be able to speak with people on the, the mission of which I am created. Uh, Bob, is he talking about Lauren De Laguna? Feelings. I'm not sure if you know it or not, but so many people talk trash about me. Yeah, Bob, I don't yeah, know. You, and this you, is, you, you know, get... this is where it really starts to get painful for me because all I want to do is be their friend. Yeah, it's pretty sad. I know. I know. I, I, Josh, I just, it's hard for Josh to see Chili, like, given their history. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> Did things not end well between you two? Josh? Nope, nope, what nope. Happened? What happened? <laughs> really? You're going to do that to me at my funeral? You're going to bring Sorry. something like that up? Yeah, Larry? I just, you know, I'm concerned. Larry? <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to trigger you there. We broke up, okay? We broke up, the, the sex wasn't good. Um, I, I tried. It's just chilly, you know, didn't really work out. Yeah, breakups are tough, buddy. They're hard to do. All right. Yeah, I know. It hurt my feelings, um, you know. And then here comes uh, that fat piece of shit, Josh. You know, I mean, look. Hey, Josh, uh, you have a rape letter, bro. You have a rape letter. You have Josh has a letter that where it says that he he tried to rape his girlfriend let's pull it up since josh wants to come in here trolling i didn't i didn't put you in timeout josh you can say whatever you want you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna pull up your i'm gonna pull up the the police report about you josh that's what i'm gonna do that
That's what I'm going to do, Josh. You want to have this conversation, Josh? Let's do it. Let's talk about this police report for Josh, everybody. So here's the police report regarding Josh. This is what his ex-girlfriend said about him. I've been a public figure for a year. A, a, a person who's in front of the... I'm going to turn my Bluetooth off on this real quick. I'm going to turn my Bluetooth off real quick, and we're going to read the police report about the AFA crew, Josh. Josh, I don't know if anybody's actually read this, but we're going to read it right now, buddy. That's why I came on here, was to have these harder conversations. Uh, cringe, Denise Lynn, as someone who's a troll like you, you're cringe. You, Katie, you got my text messages. Um, you, you were, um, what, what does it say? Yeah, Josh is a, is, is his ex-girlfriend uh, accused him of being a rapist, that he tried to rape her. And I'm going to show the police report right here, right now. You can't, it's not defamation if I tell the truth. Here's the police report written about Josh. Okay, so let's, 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 re, let's get into this a little bit. Hold on, I'm gonna turn this Bluetooth off and turn this Bluetooth on, and then I'm gonna continue. So I'll be gone for five seconds here real quick. So now let's listen to... I don't know what that was, but... but I, so Josh decided to come in. Josh, I didn't block you, dude. Hold on, so right now he has blue bacon on his live stream. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, hold on a minute here. Yeah. What? Are they having their own service? I have no idea. What's that like, though, to wait for another man to make a video? Because all the lies you said about me, how I have a criminal record and probation, and I went to jail, all those things are just not true, and there's no big... No, I was, I was law enforcement. I was law enforcement. It's fun that you think I wasn't. No, you you don't have a peace officers agreement anywhere on file, um, because we're you know we're gonna peace leave. officers agreement. What the fuck is he talking about? But but that's okay. We're that's how we're gonna serve you by publication. Because this guy right here, this guy Blue Bacon, he <laughs> hides where he lives the best. We do have an address in Seattle, but um, yeah. we we can't so find him. That guy right. right there. We're trying to find him to serve him a lawsuit. And that guy can't be found. He's wow. hid himself so where because he's a per, he's a professional wow. troll. What? Too bad confirmed. So what? anyway, Blue, I'm just you know since you're in here, man, and there's there's you know there's 264 people in here. Do you, what's that like though? Because you you haven't discredited me. There's no victims of mine. No one's come forward and said he did like like Josh's like that chick with Josh saying look what he did to my face. Is you he know? at a gas pump with his? By the way, out? Blue Bacon tried to do a breakdown of. Yep. So here's 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 the thing about Blue Bacon. What he did, he tried to. I did a breakdown of Terry versus Ohio, and then he tried to re-break it down and say where I was wrong. You get to see what a dunce cap this guy is. I mean, Blue, can you post that link? Blue, can you post that link w where you tried to correct me on Terry versus Ohio? And then and then here's the like rights on to the little video on that and just showed where he was just wrong. <laughs> He's just wrong. Blue Bacon was just totally wrong. <laughs> now all of Blue Why Bacon's trolls are coming in. in the comments, but won't like no, actually, actually, actually Blue Bacon for I'm the law scholar. You're you're, you're, you're you said you're in law enforcement, which you're not. Um you're a, a law guy. scholar live from the speedway. <laughs> right, 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 right. You know, right Bacon, I'm glad six. you came on because I was about to end this live anyway. <laughs> but here I am. Here I am right here. <laughs> What's it like, though? Oh, What's it like to like wait for me to go live? What's that like? What's that like? What's that like? What is it? <laughs> What's it like? <laughs> What's it like? Dude, hey, Blue Bacon, you can get it like this. Blue Bacon was in the room. Get that Get that screenshot. <laughs> Why can't you win your cases, so-called expert? This is the first year I've sued. So that's just another That's just another death strike for Blue Bacon. He's screenshotting that he's in his chat. It's over. He's done. Yeah, he's getting it's sued. Over. Sued? It's deleted. He's going to delete Blue Bacon. Obviously, he's going to be banned him. from the internet. Right, and you know when he laughs like that, he's laughing because he's won and not because he's frazzled and irritated and panicking and weak. It's right? just crazy that you guys all got taken down by Chili in his car with a ring light at pump six. Yeah, you know what's it, it's interesting, like Kate, four. is you know he was able to deliver this type of a death blow from a speedway. Imagine what's going to happen when he goes live from White Castle. We are fucked. We're fucked. <laughs> We're absolutely fucked. Absolutely. 
Absolutely. Oh my God, maybe this is his road trip to White Castle. That's all this has been. <laughs> Dude, anybody. And none of my, none of the cases that I've been a part of that I'm working with other people on, uh, those cases have not come to fruition yet, Blue. Um, so, you know, I, so I don't really know what you're talking about. This is the first year I've ever sued people, really. So wh what else you have to say, Blue? Where else you got? Why'd you run from uh, two debates that, that you asked for? <laughs> I guess if you back it up, he was on the Listen, phone man, with Blue. If you want to come on the channel, Blue Bacon, if you... Uh, uh, Blue Bacon wants to have a debate, everybody. Blue Bacon, um, you know, it's it's a really waste of my time. You know what I mean? Because you don't have any mission. You're just, you know what I'm saying? It's like, it's like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, in which way do you hey. want to debate me? Do you know what I'm saying? Like, Back the like, video like, which up. Way Blue do you was on debate? the phone with him. No, no, we're not up there yet. We're not up there yet. Which way do you want to debate me? I mean, in what facet do you want to debate me, Blue Bacon? Oh, <laughs> right here. That's where it goes on. What what number? Can someone what, what ask number you? What number are you calling from, Jeremy? I gotta I gotta take my phone off private. What, what's up? Nothing. Oh. Wait, did he just call him Jeremy again? Yeah, that's it. I mean, he's got his name. He's got his name. Definitely his name. <laughs> here. Let's 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 hear. Let's hear from Jeremy. Jeremy from Seattle. <laughs> Yep. You're, Jeremy you're, you're Jeremy from Seattle. You're on live. <laughs> I got to go. Man. I'm, supposed to be, I'm supposed to meet someone right now. What's on your I mind? I got to take my phone off. I got to take all the locks off my phone. I have like 400 different. I have an app that goes over it now. He has 400 different locks on his phone, people. <laughs> okay. Jeremy, totally not where shady. At, where, 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 where are you at? Um, My phone's on, dude. Where are you at, Jeremy? Sorry, oh, cell coverage. So scary. <laughs> cell coverage is bad from the grave. Where are you at, taking dude? a second. I mean, my phone's on. You're not calling it. I'm. I'm waiting. You'll probably it to get rain. better service at Pump uh, Five. Uh, you know. Right. 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 I mean, the guy makes videos that about me. That needs His to be in like a Saw movie. Me. All the thumbnails, um, you know, are about me. It's like. Yeah. It's like. Or like, Deliverance Part wrong. Two. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like he literally is obsessed with me. Like, I mean, you, you want to? This is my better side, Jeremy. This is my better side. No. You, you, you want to get a picture of this side? Do you like this side better? Is this the side that you like? What is this a pretty weirdo. side for you, Jeremy? It's or a good do you side. Like the rougher side? With the, you know, look, totally look straight guy. Side. Makes everything sexual. I'm, I'm, dude, I, I've got to go, Jeremy. So this is your chance to call me out for hey. the the hey. somehow the terrible person I am that you can't find any victims. You you can't get it. Uh, it you, there's no one who's going to come forward. That that's gonna say that that I've done something wrong, you know. I'm waiting for the guy to call my phone. Apparently, I sent him my number. I still have that number, but I've attached another number to it. That number is dormant. I reactivated it just now. I turned it back on right what here, Jeremy, for you, so you could call because I now have another number I use on he that line. He magically reactivated it. What is he? What is he? Verizon Wireless customer service agent or what? Yep. So he's saying he deactivated his old number and changed it, but reactivated just now so Blue Bacon could call him. Yep. What a nice guy. Very skilled, I'm not, too. I'm not surprised he took you guys down. Yeah. What a so, great person. You got to beat this. You don't. You just sub, you roll over, submit, and you just sip poo poo right in the gut. Tana, <laughs> chink, honor, self delete. Can't, I can't live this down. I can't. I mean, it's just, it's done for me. God bless. That's my backup number. So, all of ring. You. so I send disgusting sexual emails. No, I don't. You can you can try it, but it's just not true. Uh, you sure? No, nope. I want to nope. put your balls in my mouth like a, and then nope. swallow your semen. Something wrong with you, dude. No, How no, deep no, do you want me when I hold you down and you can't get away? Yeah, as I recall, he did say that I mean he gave um, another man very specific instructions on how he would like this man to fillet him, as I recall, right? I believe he also included uh, the man's mother so that, or sister. Mother and sister could get involved in the, in the fellatio action. Yes, but they weren't allowed to swallow. Only the man sending the email was. Right, right, right. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, I, I think that <laughs> that's normal. It's not disgusting or sexual at all. It's a normal thing to do. It's a normal thing to yeah, do. Chili's a normal guy. Just hanging out at the pump. 
there's really something wrong with you, dude. Ditto. I mean, I'm, I, I gotta go, dude. So like, I don't know what you're doing, man. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Oh, he calls from an unknown number. Why'd you call from an unknown number, Jeremy? Why not just see Jeremy's so afraid to share any information about himself. He hides himself. Uh, your phone number didn't come. Th- it didn't, it didn't, it didn't come through, Jeremy. We're, we're all way. Oh, Jeremy's got to get his camera set up. He's got to get on. He's got to get all of his audience ready. I, I'm going to talk to, I'm going to talk to the guy I'm obsessed with. I'm going to talk to You can tell he's so nervous. Jeremy right now is putting on, uh, fixing his hair, getting himself done. I've got to get on camera. I get to talk to Chili. I get to talk to Chili. <laughs> Jeremy, I'll only get on this the phone with you if you don't live bacon stream is it. Laughing but I'm going to check the, the channel right now, Jeremy. And if you live stream it, then I'm not going to talk to you on the phone. I'm I'm going to check your channel, Jeremy. And if you if it, you don't get to you, 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 to you don't you don't get to live stream it, Jeremy. There's the stipulations to the stream, dude. You don't get to live stream the the video, or I or I won't talk to you. You can record it and then play it later. You can <laughs> film yourself, but you I'm not going to have you uh, profit off of my live stream. You can you can play it later, Blue Bacon. <laughs> He'll make <laughs> more I'm that way watching anyway. Right now. Yeah, not and Blue so Bacon. Not streaming, the then I won't take phone call. Only Chili can profit. Where are you? Nope, I don't. I don't see anything here. I do see just pictures of me all up and down your videos, dude. <laughs> I think he wants to bang Blue Bacon. Is that you, Jeremy? Uh, no, this is not Jeremy. Is this Chili? Is this Jeremy? No, my name. I believe you're talking about blue bacon. <laughs> this, you're not blue bacon, dude. No, I'd have to. I, I, I'm blue bacon. I'm not Jeremy. I don't know where you're getting the name from. Well, I th- so was I it James? Was, was it James Fuelner? There you go. Okay, so what's up, man? So I, you know, do you want to? Do you want to? Do you? Well, do you want to go out with me? No. I, I you don't, he, he's totally right. straight. You don't want to no date me? How straight he is. Uh, no, thank you. I appreciate the offer. I'm going to get a hard pass. Well, why? Let me, let, let me ask you a question. How come you're so obsessed? You no, no, no. I, I, well, I brought, I brought you on and, you know, you've made so many videos about me. I just got to ask you, man. What, why, are, why are you obsessed with me? I'm not. I'm really not. But it's fun that you think that that's the kind of attention you get. It's more that you just really make it very easy for me to make content. Because you say a lot of things that contradict a lot of things that you either said before. I make it easy for you to make content. Is that what you said? Are you able to let me finish or not? Well, I'm just chi- yeah, I'm just bro. chiming in. Up. Go go ahead. Like, I'm really sorry, like, James. I'm really no, sorry. Here's my question. Well, obviously you're not going to let me finish because you're still fine. You're still fine. <laughs> I'm just you I'm trying to. Let me finish. Please let me finish. You sound like you sound like a cop. You sound James. You sound like a cop. You, but you sound like a cop. How you get so mad if people don't let you talk? <laughs> what? Did Chili, so, Chili just said no, that? I'm just saying. You asked me twice for a debate, and both times you decided not to do it. I'm curious why. <laughs> well, you're a troll, James. You're you're I'm not actually. I provide factual information on my channel. No, I mean, uh, there's the fact that you don't like the information, which is factual and can be proven, can be backed up with real evidence, does not make me a troll. Uh, no, actually, you know, if you wanted to debate anything, what I would debate you, James, is, is that you made a video, but, yeah, you're, James, James, you're facing a lawsuit, dude, did you know that? Did you, did you know that? Oh, right, he's like a cop, he's like a cop, where if, if, if you don't, if you don't let him talk, he loses his mind. Yeah, I mean, he's 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 really really bad. He's he's, he's, he's like a just like a pig. I mean, James talks a lot. He, he likes to talk. He likes to talk. And I, you know, I wish the best for you. Okay. Well, James, James, the biggest question I have for you though, is, you know, the only thing that only made me pay attention to you is that you made a video trying to like rebut what I know about Terry versus Ohio. And, and just so you know, James, I, it's, I watched it and I laughed my ass off because you were wrong about, you you were wrong about everything. 
you know, put a one in the chat if you think James is an expert on Terry versus Ohio. Put a one in the chat if you think James is an expert in Terry versus Ohio. Put a two if you think I'm an expert Wait, in so Terry is this versus Freeman Ohio. On the phone? Let's just take a vote. Put a one if you think James is an expert on Terry versus Ohio. Put a two if you think that I'm an expert on Terry. You're very biased chat who hasn't figured out why you're lying to them. It's, it's, you know, two is for me. Two is for me. One is for James. Well, Let's see how many it's trolls we have in here. It's your chat comprised people who are experts or would they not know? I feel like that's, you're not really dropping. James, you got a bunch of, you, you got a bunch of trolls in here, James. You have your video, and I have my video. You got a bunch and of trolls. And clearly says that you're trying to make some racist out of Cherry Bristol Ohio. You're a moron, dude. Listen, I don't want to call you names, but but you're kind of, no, 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 no. Hold on. You're, when you talk about Terry, yeah, I mean, you've been talking the whole time, man. It's impossible to even get a, a, a word in edgewise with you when you're talking. Like, Notice he, he just doesn't so listen much. to anything. This guy's a dunce cap. It's incredible. Yeah, but yeah, but you're but you don't know what you're talking about. But you don't know what you're talking about. But you don't know what you're talking about. That's the most important thing. No, listen, listen, James. I only brought you on to ask you a couple of questions. Why are you so obsessed with me? Is it just to make money? Because you're getting good views now. You're getting good. I'm just asking you. Why are you so obsessed with me? But you didn't. You said what? You're 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 what? How do I affect your life? In which way? But in which way do I affect your life? I don't know you. We've never met. I'm not the governor of, of Washington. So why do you care so much about me? Why do you make videos about me? I cared about Caleb Slay. I cared about Caleb Slay. Well, she's a fraud is how she affects me. But I'm asking, I asked, I asked you a question. So that you guys, just so you know, what that's called, what that's called is whataboutism. When I ask him a question and then he says, well, what about this? Instead of answering the question, it's a perfect fallacy. And that's what he did. You don't want people to rule a conversation oh, by, well, what about this? I just asked him a direct question. Instead of answer it, what he did was then said, well, what about that? That's called whataboutism. You guys can look it up on Google. It's called whataboutism. So can you answer the question now? Because I asked you a question that I want to see. This is the whole, this is why I don't go on your shitty troll channels. And I never will. Because you guys, what you do is you overwhelm a conversation. And you don't allow the other person to have any kind of word in edgewise. No, you're going to answer my question first. Why are you so? How do I affect? How You know, I didn't. How do I affect your life? No, no. I asked you a question. You didn't answer it. Why are you so obsessed with me? And why would you make? You can't talk and listen at the same time. So let me try it again. Why are you so? Why are you so Bro, obsessed you with me? Thing. And why do you just make videos about me when you don't know me? And I, I don't affect your life in any way, shape, or form. Let's be clear at this point. Like Chili's heard nothing that Blue has said at this point at all. Nothing. Nothing. My mind is either you don't unlock it, you break it open. No, that was like the most fascinating thing was him being such a hypocrite and being like, you know, you can't you can't listen if you're talking. And every time Blue Bacon talked, Chili talked over him so you couldn't hear no, him. At this point, I would, I would place every penny in my savings account um, on the fact that Chili has not actually heard nor processed one word that's coming. Uh, through the phone. He has no clue. I mean, he's not, some people will like listen to respond. You know what I mean? So they're not actively listening. They're, they're hearing what you're saying, but just sort of building how they're going to respond. Chili doesn't even do that. Chili just completely blocks it out and just keeps going on his tangent. Can you just, because I, mean, I have a, I have, I have an actual like audience who's on a mission. Why are you so obsessed with me though? I'm just trying to understand it. If you stop talking, I can answer. Okay, go ahead. And I hope that you let me well, if you're going to go on some rant about some okay, stupid well, shit, I probably won't. So I can't the okay. Are you done? Well, if you're going to answer, I will be. But if, if you're not, I won't be. Okay, you're still going. May I? Yes or no? He grasps I'm, I'm so waiting. hard for control. That's a yes or no. I'm, <laughs> he's, such, he's just like a cop. Yes no. he's, he's just like a cop. I'm trying to get you to answer the question, and apparently you won't. So May I continue, yes or no? I'm waiting for you to answer the question. How do I affect your life? Besides making you money. Here's the thing. Okay, well, you're still talking. I don't know what you expect me to do about that. You already said that only one of us is talking at the time. This is how annoying his channel is, too. Go ahead. Do you mind if I... Do you want the answer or not? I'm waiting. Okay. 
all you have, all you have to do is close your mouth and shoot me. <laughs> there, I just did it right there. Okay. So here's the answer to your question. How do you affect my life? And why am I obsessed with you? I'm not obsessed with you. As I stated before, you make it really easy to create content about you in a manner that does affect people in general by preventing them from being, you know, suckered into what I personally believe is a scam of some sort. Oh, okay. So but you have to now answer that, though. How is, how is anybody getting scammed from me? Explain, well, explain that. No, no, but you haven't you explained the scam that I do. How, how, what yeah. scam is it? Where, where are people get, my products yeah. are $25 yeah. for yeah. the, you know, but, but well, because I want to have a conversation here with you. Remember, I don't make videos about you. I don't know you. You're the creepy guy calling who's, who's following my feed to make videos. You're the creeper, but, but you're, the, but you are creepy, dude. No, 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 no. Hold on a minute. You are creepy though, right? Says creepy like you are creepy. No, but you, but you make videos about me. I don't know you. We've never met. I'm not in government where you live. So like you making videos about me is really creepy. And then, but you just said, you just said, I'm a scammer. Okay, so, but you have to explain that. But you're not, you're not. You're just, you're just talking like, like, like a cop. And so tell me why and which one. So, so my poster for the printed laminated ones, 139 bucks, pretty expensive, but you know, I've only sold, you know, a hundred of those or so and everybody likes them. And then the other one's $99. And then the other products I have are $24.99 and $19.99, $5. So, but you said I'm scamming people. So tell me how I'm scamming people. You have the floor to explain how I scam them. Okay. Now you're talking again. I don't know how you think conversations work, but it's not this. If you can't figure out how the basic conversation works, I struggle with leaving you understand how the law works. But that, you know, that's a cheap shot on my part. I do apologize for that. And I will answer your question. But I'm going to do the second question, not the third. No, I, I want to know how I'm scamming people. You got the floor. You, you said you'd answer it. I want to know how, how I'm scamming people. I'm trying. Yeah, of course you want. You, you, you said I was a scammer, dude. There's there's 320 people listening. They want to answer for the question. And we're, I asked you a direct question. Can you just explain how I scam anybody when my products are either for free? I give them for free. Does everybody know that? You can get my products totally for free. So, so I'm just wondering how is a scam if I give my products away for nothing? So, so can you, can you just let me know how I'm a scammer? I'm trying to, may I? Well, but you said you weren't going to answer the question and that's not, no, I, that's why I don't go on your shitty troll channels. Cause what you do is you bombard people and you just go over and over on stupid shit and they can't respond. Yeah. You, you, you follow me around like a creep, dude. You're a creepy guy. You're super creepy, man. You make content about me all the time. You're, I'm creeped out by you. So it's creepy as fuck, dude. Just think about it. Like, it's creepy, dude. You're a creepy guy, dude. And then the fact that we can't find you, that you hide your identity. You, This guy hides his identity so well. Right. So can you just... Can Chili just say we can't find you and he's upset that he's no, in but, a danger? But, but that's not life. the question I want you to answer. You called me a scammer, so I want I want I want to know what that answer is. Okay, so we're gonna we're not gonna continue the call then. We're gonna let you go here. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. If you're gonna play that game, I'll do the third one. I'll do the third one. I wanna I wanna hear your answer how I'm a scammer. I'm trying to give it to you. Spend okay. five minutes not letting me give an answer. But here we go. Ready? Okay, go ahead. The reason you're a scammer is because you put out false information <laughs> and you try to get people to give you money. Now, I believe you know this information is not correct. Oh, really? And you you have a history oh, I of do? doing some usual, but if you, if you want an answer, you got to let me give it, bud. <laughs> Why you got to let me give it, okay? <laughs> okay. So you have this history throughout your life of getting involved in what I might call schemes. Other people might call it something else. <laughs> What like like what kind of scheme of so where's the person who said I was the schemer? Who's the who's the who's the witness to that? It was a company I started that failed. That that everybody invested in it lost their money. That's what happens when people invest in a tech company. So the the company failed, and and people and people lost and people lost. No, I don't. I don't. No, no, I don't. I don't have a lot of businesses. So then he brings this up again. Now, how many times, he, how many stories has he told about coded friends now? Just uh, like, I believe at one point it was doing really well. It made money. Then he admitted that it failed, uh, but nobody really lost any money. Nobody got scammed. Now he's saying that people did lose money. 
Um, what Blue Bacon didn't have a chance to ask, I'm assuming, because Chili won't let him fucking talk, is I would be curious what people lost money on precisely. Like, where did the money hemorrhage out? What were the expenses? Because he can't answer that question. There was never even an app in development. It didn't happen. I like how his explanation is, uh, oh, that's what happens when you, you lose money when you invest in a tech company. No, that's not usually what happens, just only when Chili's running that company. Right, right. The investors for like Google and Amazon and uh, Facebook, Twitter, and so like all those investors would disagree, would absolutely disagree. No, I don't. I've had five companies in my entire life, so that's not a bunch of businesses. Most people are not entrepreneurs, and entrepreneurs have far more than that. So, coded friends. Now, you said I. You said I have a history of scamming people. Who is it? Which person? Like, like with who said that though? You're the one saying that. You're making up lies. Who said that? Do you have any of my investors? My investors have have been heard on the phone. Two or three of them, and none of them have said that. You're the only one saying that. But but nobody. So so. So what this guy's doing is he just he just called me a scammer and then said that a tech company that I had that failed and everybody lost their money and everybody knows they lost their money and I know the loss, right? He's trying to say I'm a scammer because I started a company and it failed. Look up the success rate for technology companies. Look them up and you'll see. I made it four years in my tech company, which was pretty good and I'm pretty proud of that. I'm really sad my investors lost their money, but that doesn't make you a scammer when you raise money as an entrepreneur and you start a corporation. That's not how it works. That's not scamming. That's actually trying something, taking a shot at something. So, 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 no, right. So, and, and just so you guys know, I've heard, I've had several investors on here that I've talked to, you, you know, worked so hard to get those companies done. And, you know, just so you know, you know, the company that he mentioned, Coded Friends, it was so heartbreaking, you know, I even talking about it's hard because I put my heart and soul into something, you know? So guys like this though, who don't try anything, they're just little sucky bus off your energy. You know, it's just so normal. So, so, so then, so then what other companies did I raise? No, what other country, what other companies did I raise hundreds of thousands of dollars for the failed? There's, can you name it? Can you name another company? Can you rate, can you name another company that I've raised more than a hundred thousand dollars for? I raised far more than that for Coded Friends, my friend. But can you list any other companies that I've raised over $100,000 from? I do know that your alleged knowledge of law is so incredibly bad. No, no, we're talking about me being Thank a scammer you. right I now, Blue Bacon. You don't have a single witness. Nobody has come forward and said that I ever cheated them out of money. But now you're on here saying that I did. So you don't have any witnesses, though. You're just talking shit. And that's a lie because there actually is a civil suit. So I would... I would again go to uh, that civil suit. There definitely are people who have uh, complained that he scammed them. He's just literally never going to pay them back. Yeah. So I just explained clearly that I had a tech company that failed. Oh, Susie, I don't, I don't need you, dude. I'm really sorry to see you go, Susie. But it was nice to have had you here for a little while. Didn't he just go over how he's not going to ban people? So... <laughs> um blue but so that's not a scammer if you try to start a company so then what else what else you know why do you do you make videos about me just to make money no i do it to protect people from you but you're not protecting anybody from me no one has seen me and no one has seen me and then said oh man thank god i saw blue bacon no you don't you're a liar you are such a fraud dude listen you make videos about me to make money do you make money from your YouTube channel? Yes, yeah, I do profit off it. Yes. How much money do you make? That's a good question. No, how much money do you make? How much people? How much? How, how much are your super chats? I've rich. seen your super chats. What do you make on an average live feed where you just disparage me? Kate, I actually no, took a page from your book on this one. Money, um, how much money? Oh, Penny, you can go too. You were. Gosh, I wish I knew. You were. You were blue sucking as well. Oh, they're blue suckers. <laughs> so hold on, by, by taking a page from my book, did you tell him that you were making hundreds of thousands of dollars? Oh, I, I was giving him, I was saying 30, I think $30,000 a day. Yeah. Uh, I think I gave him a number of, uh, oh man, the people I helped, it was something about uh, people involved. And I gave him $5 billion. Uh, so you got like, 
Yeah, you got like Sally. Yeah, I said I've there. I've created thirty thousand companies. He's like, no, you have no one. Ah, you're probably right. It's closer to twenty eight five. Uh, he liked that. That's a lie that you told him. It's closer to twenty eight five. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Boy, with numbers like that. He's so, but, but how much money do you make per live stream? How much money do you make per live stream? How, how much money do you make per live stream? I don't know. It depends on live stream. No, but you make like hundreds of dollars each live stream. I make the exact amount, uh, you know, the same same amount as each and every time. I don't know. Hell no. So you are you jealous? What tips? He's like acting. You make a ton of money off me, don't you? I I mean, it depends on what you call a ton of money. You What'd you make this money? last month? What was your Charlie monthly income on YouTube and Super Chats? What'd you make? I don't know. I don't have information. Yes, you do. Guys. You have it on Google Analytics on your phone. I can pull up well, mine right now. I, I, I can pull up. Here, let me let, let me show you how. No, it's it's on his phone. He can pull it up and look at well, it. I don't care how to do it. I know how to do it. I'm so here's mine, guys. Here's what mine looks like. This is mine right here. You guys can see it. See that right there? There's my analytics. You can see it. Uh, it looks like two point three thousand dollars in revenue from YouTube and super chats. That's how much money I've I've made from YouTube, just so everybody can see it. What's yours, Blue? What's yours? How much money are you making off me? Heck, I have no idea. You're making a lot more than twenty three hundred, aren't you? Am I? I mean, I mean, are you? So jealous? You? you tell me. No, I mean, uh, why why can't you just answer the question? Why are you such a fraud, dude? You called me a fraud, well, but no, you have no I witnesses. Have you. you don't have a single person who said I've cheated them. Not one person. Any not one person but how much money are you making off me dude no why don't we just let everybody know how much money you're making Several off? People. how much money do you make per live stream how much money why don't you why don't you open up open up your youtube studio open up your youtube studio blue bacon open up your youtube studio and show everybody how much money you're making off of me open i just showed mine dude i just showed it to everybody open up yours well, you don't have YouTube Studio on your phone? I'll bet you do. So how much money are you making? You called me a scammer and said that my tech company failed. Hey, hey, Dunscap, let me ask you a question. How many companies have you started? Oh, I estimate 30,000. No, 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 no. I mean, company. answer it's honestly. How many companies have you started? Where you started a, a corporate charter, how many companies have you started? How many? Uh, you might be right. Probably no, how many? Zero. He started zero companies. That's how many. Oh, how much money have you raised from investors? How many investors have you raised money from? How many money? How, how many that's investors? That's what makes a successful business from? to him is raising money from investors. Yeah, you're a better entrepreneur with the more people you can steal from. Wow. I showed you guys. What fantastic stream quality he's got. He really is a tech genius. Um, he's got to pull away from the phone. On their channel. Because when it comes down to actually showing you guys oh. money, and then, and then what he did, he had nobody. Well, clearly it's because people like you can't, we're, we're, are just leeching all of the money he would be making. We're, we're, yeah, no. His production I, quality is so low. I think so, because obviously he and I would have a very yeah. similar audience base. Um People who watch me and support me definitely are inclined to watch and support someone <laughs> this like that. Face. I'm stealing that away from him. I'm sorry. This is why I'm self-deleting. I can't live with the guilt anymore. I'm ruining Chili's live streams. Blue Bacon, you are ruining Chili's live streams. Just yeah, that. it's the worst. He unblocked me. I didn't even mean to do this. I was just like, oh, he said he unblocked me. Let's test it. And so I called him out for driving and reading his phone. And then he pulled over into this gas station to have the conversation. All right, cool. Let's have it. It's the I only just, way I get to do it. All right. He sounds like he's in an airplane. Where, where are the victims? Oh, so bad. Where's the person I hurt? Where's the where's the weeping babe? Ow, my brain. Tina Slay. We, we, we've talked about Tina Slay Richardson. I went to try to help her. I was I called literally can't even. I didn't have any power. I couldn't help her. How was she? Doing? I paid for her to throw people. I mean, I, I can tell myself. you what basically what's happening here because it's hard to understand. Yeah, because literally, like, he, I think he's got the phone too close to his other phone or something. But that is just unintelligible it, nonsense. Yeah, I. I don't know what's happening. As somewhere at around maybe this point, I started recording my own audio. Sorry. Uh, because I didn't know what was picking up because I was doing a stream capture. And I think maybe I got some of his audio and I realized, what if you can't even hear me at all? Like I, I wasn't really looking uh, at the video. I wasn't in a position to do that. Right now, he's like, who is my victim? Who have I ever hurt? And I, I, I brought up Tina Slay. And, and I think Tina's here. And sorry if I uh, uh, use your name when I shouldn't have. But I was like, look, you 
she was a victim. And so he's trying to be like, oh, well, did, you, did she tell you that I bought her food? Like, that doesn't make her not a victim of you. Oh, she's a scammer. Like, like establish why. And he, I've looked over Tina's case. I've talked to Tina about it. And I, I wasn't able to provide much help because it is a complicated thing. Uh, but I think I was able to put a lot of stuff in context for her so that she can reach out to the actual professionals and then move forward if she makes that decision. Chili has no idea what he's talking about, so his advice is absolutely useless, as we've seen time and time again for every time he tries to insert himself into some sort of legal narrative. But that's basically what he's rambling about at this point. Yeah, I mean, just... Uh, yeah. You know, Tina Slay certainly is not a scammer. She didn't benefit from this at all. She suffered, really. People. I'm going to continue to help people. And I'm going to stay super, super focused on making sure that I educate and I help people. But it's just absolutely crazy. I mean, you guys just heard. You scam people. Who are the people? Nobody. You know, you do this. Well, where's the person? When you do someone wrong, typically they're willing to stand up and talk against you. He doesn't have that. It just doesn't exist. So, all right, I've got to get to where, how far away am I anyway? I pulled over yeah. randomly because I was I was having a good time talking, and then that douchebag called in. Um, it's just incredible, you know. Remember, you know, we're not going to stop. Is he still at pump four? I mean, you know, and to all the people who over there, yeah, and you he learned doesn't about stop. Me from the channel, you know, I recommend you go back and watch some of my. This is the asshole that makes because, it so you can't get gas. You know, we're on a mission to yeah. change a corrupt system. I know there's like a line of cars and behind him right now. And if your dad's a cop or your brother's a cop or your best friend. But to be fair, he did stop the car to have this conversation. Agree, then that's cool. That go with God. Gross. Do what you're going to do. I wish you the best of luck in your life. But it's like, I'm going to change this rotten system called policing. Yeah, I think that should be the response. Every time some Kate always wins, Kate always loses her kids. I mean, the okay. woman Kate, who you guys are, watching, <laughs> master, that she I can literally money. hear your kids right now. <laughs> that woman <clears throat> lost two of her children. Her own mother uh, filed for a protective order against uh, her kids in 2010, what 2012. The? It was on Turtle Boy's your channel. Your mom had a restraining order against your kids. Yeah, she <laughs> said it was on Turtle Boy's channel. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It was on Turtle Boy's oh. channel. By the way, yeah, at this no. point, I'm saying, oh, sweetie, shh, 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 shh. That's, that's, I think, what the noise I'm making in the background. Uh, oh, I, know, no, no, to hear that. I mean, this is why I have to self-delete, because I really didn't want anyone to find out that in 2012, my, my elderly mother got a protective order against my children, who I believe would have been five and <laughs> three at the time. Something they were like dangerous, that. those thuggish, ruggish kids. They were, dangerous they were. to society. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hate, I, hate, I hate that he knows that about me. Okay, you know what I think is interesting? So Thankfully, true, we figured definition. out how to get out of crimes because he says if you buy someone food, then they can't be a victim. So if you're out there and you're thinking about <laughs> killing someone, buy them a pizza first. You're Gucci. Right. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. That's what I was trying to do. Okay. Yeah, that's what I Sorry, the comments right now. Somebody said, uh, it's on Turtle Boy's channel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Right, right, right. Turtle Boy would never Imagine put up being a and judge and, and like, exactly seeing, like Imagine oh, coming into work as a judge and you're like, oh, this grandmother wants to get a restraining order against a five year old. <laughs> right, right. To, to be fair, just so we can clear this up right now, what he's talking about is a court document, I believe from like 2010, actually, it was where my mother was filing for visitation with my children. The reason being is that I was um, in an abusive marriage and she wasn't able to see or speak to me nor the children. Uh, so she was understandably concerned as far as like, you know, 12 years later, I see the woman almost every single week. We talk like four times a week. Shiz can, shiz can vouch. I can attest to that. Right. Talk to your mom. <laughs> I am always on the phone with my mother. <laughs> like It's just something I do. But I, we've gotten over the fact that she had to, you know, get a restraining order against my preschool age children at one point. <laughs> yeah, what you hear in the background is not a child. That's just a mirage. I'm throwing my voice to make it sound like, you know, I'm trusting She's a children. ventriloquist. She's been practicing. You're doing really good. I have. Oh, Chuck Bronson. <laughs> Chuck Bronson, dude. Chuck Bronson. Love you, dude. I love Chuck Bronson, man. Thanks for coming by. So, you know, it's like um, 
you know, the woman that these people are hanging out with is as bad as, as Josh from AFA. You know, Josh has a video where a woman made a video and said, like, and she's all beat up. There's a police report that said he jumped on top of me, put Rest his hand over peace, my mouth, Josh. and then she screamed and ran out of the room. I mean, that's that's crazy. You know, Kate lost her kids and uh, she's, she's charged with neglecting her children where the, they took her kids away. Really, we were charged. <laughs> Remember, according to him, a charge isn't a conviction, therefore it doesn't matter. Well, no, I mean, there would have to be a charge there, too. Um, <laughs> right, yeah. I just say, there would have to be a charge. They would have, you, like, what you got? Like, I think that my criminal records would put out there. I have zero convictions, period. So by, uh, by Chili's metrics, I'm actually, I have no criminal record. Whatsoever. Oh, yeah, there's no, there are no felonies, so it doesn't count. Right, right, right. But yeah, no, I mean, to be I all you have to say is that. nope, and it doesn't exist. Nope. I mean, I have been very open about what my really, mostly driving without a license, mostly driving without a license. Uh, yes, I that. have been thwarted in court many times by the nope argument. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I have been using it all the time now. You know, from now on, every time he says something that I don't like, I'm just going to say nope. Crazy. I also he don't have a criminal record. I mean, so he's a fame really dude. Dude. He keeps nope. on saying horrible things about me. No, nope. but but then there's no proof of anything. No, nope. anything criminal I've ever done. There's no victim to the criminality. No, nope. so anything okay. that I've done okay. wrong. Okay, look at this lady wants him to move. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get gas. I'm, I'm working the store. Oh no, there's it's just a troll. I don't want to talk to him. No, no. Um, so that is unbelievable. Did that just happen? Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah. Just Did that just happen? That just happened. That just happened. Oh my god, that's unbelievable. Who was on the phone? Somebody called the fucking Phillips sixty six station and asked her to take the phone out to away. a guy in the car. Really crazy. Blue was that you, Blue? Person. I mean. He's a crazy no, I dude. that I was not brilliant. With brilliant. Whoever did me. that, we but, need to get them on no now. <laughs> I didn't even know what happened. Anything criminal I've ever done, there's no victim to the criminality. So, anything that I've done <laughs> this wrong, is, is, is she like on the phone with the cops or something? What's going on? No, it's also striking how not she so should be. She was about just saying, Oh, yeah, that's a troll. I don't want to talk to you. Somebody watching the stream called the station, the, oh, the no, gas station. It's just a troll. I don't want to And said, can you walk the Take phone out to shit the guy out? Right, right, right. Watch it. Watch it again. Watch it again, okay? This All right, check it out. Awesome. Watch. 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 Lisa, we're, they're tracking him like a great white. That's how they So, know. you know, yeah. it's like, um, you know, the woman that these people are hanging out with is as bad as, as Josh from AFA. You know, Josh has a video where a woman made a video and said, look what he did. And she's all beat up. There's a police report that said he jumped on top of me, put his hand over my mouth. And then she screamed and ran out of the room. I mean, that's that's crazy. You know, Kate lost her kids and uh, she's, she's charged with neglecting her children where the, they took her kids away. Really crazy. Blue Bacon, that guy's, an, I mean, he's a creepy dude. He keeps on saying horrible things about me. But, but then there's no proof of anything. Anything criminal I've ever done, there's no victim to the criminality. So anything that I've done wrong is... This is unbelievable. Oh, my God. <laughs> She's persistent. I don't know who you are. Oh no, there's it's just a troll. I don't oh, want to you talk backed to it up. I thought you he came back. I was like, damn. Um, so he, he can't so it's like <laughs> he has my city, uh, he can't find me. Chuck. And yet people are while he's traveling the country Chuck able Ronson. to put a phone into his hands. That's what I mean. Maybe yeah. that's why people should be a little more cautious about the information they provide over the internet. Because right. I don't want people coming up to me going, here's a phone. Like that's weird. I'm not in the matrix. I'm not taking any pills. Like, get out of here. I would have taken the phone if I were him. He's kind of a. He's I kind of a. The judge either. told yeah. him though, your your infamous court case. Didn't the judge say like, you know, were you streaming? And that's how they figured out where you are. And he said yes. And he's like, oh, you probably shouldn't do that. We don't that, stop answering the phones at gas stations. It's unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> and Chuck's not rich, guys. Make sure you guys subscribe to Chuck Bronson's channel uh, and turn around and make sure you. Uh, you 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 pay, you you pay it forward for that man because he's a he's an icon in this in this uh, actual activism business, you know. But um, so there it is, right there, you guys. Um, you guys just saw. What the there fuck is he accomplished? No proof of anything about me bad, but it's not what this is about. This is about us changing the system, and that's why the all the little all the little police families are supporting these people, and everybody who's against change is supporting these people, and they're no, making a ton of money. But if you guys are uh, watching on a troll channel, and you actually take the time to watch my content, you might find out what actual integrity and being genuine is all about. If you actually take the time to watch the channel and listen to the things that I teach and the things that I preach, 
and I follow the things that I teach and I preach and I put my money where my mouth is. Oh my God, Every single no. dime that I make from my online store to lead laws, I spend 100% on change. $75. 100%. Uh, and yeah, Gloria, I already sent your trifold out. So he doesn't even yeah, use I give Someone away all of my digital products gets, for free. I sell my digital the products online. He gets yell at the, the police after he's tried to use his trifold. Right, so he right, doesn't right. practice the things that he preaches. Yeah, the trifold Stay doesn't away work. from me, gas station lady. <laughs> digital poster, digital ebook, uh, digital trifold. But if you can't afford it and you email me, I'll give it to you for free. So, it's, I, I mean, I've always just been this way because it's yeah. about the mission. So, anyway, listen, I have got to go. I've got to go do something else right now. But uh, love you guys. Thank you for staying with me. I appreciate it. This was a really long live. I didn't plan on on this being so long, so live. But but um, I'm really glad that I didn't I plan on getting so absolutely long and so my own car. all the content in the world from that. We'll see whether or not you have defamed me in federal tort law. But that will remain to be seen. So we'll we'll see how that goes. But uh, blue you, will face, you will face being served, and you will you will you are going to federal tort law. That's 100. Rest in peace, blue you know, bacon. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate the good compliments. And for all those people watching on those troll channels, you know, yeah, think about the substance of which you are. <laughs> what? You know, what we're leaving behind for the next <laughs> generation. Not this a scammer. That so that's the plus. That has to be changed. And that's my mission. I mean, he just like it's unintelligible. Like just mishmash what comes out of his mouth. Think about the substance about what you are. What? What does that mean? I don't know what I don't know what that means. What is he asking? Stimba. You to do? Right. Like, Remember who you are for free. So, <laughs> it, I mean, I've always just been this way because it's about the mission. So, anyway, listen, I have got to go. I've got to go do something else right now. But uh, love you guys. Thank you for staying with me. I appreciate it. This was a really long live. I didn't plan on on this being so long, so live. But but um, I'm really glad that guy called in because, dude, I hope you get all the content in the world from that. We'll see whether or not you have defamed me. In Is he talking about blue or the gas yeah. station? Yeah, no, he's giving me permission we'll to use the content. Goes, so, but uh, you will face you will face being served, and you will you will you are going to federal. He keeps giving me dates on where I'm going to be serving. Never Thank happens. You. I appreciate it. I appreciate the good compliments. And for all those people, when he says served, he means channels, like the movie you know, Step It Up. Think about the substance of which you are. The substance of which you are. The next generation. This is a bad system that has to be changed. I'm a meat computer driving a flesh carcass. Thank you. Will you guys please just think about the substance of what you are for once. Think about it. I'm just Especially thinking today. About the, the, the Knowing is half the battle. With that gas station lady. Like, ma'am, I need you. There's a, probably a man outside of your gas station talking into a light in his car. I need you to bring the phone to him right now, please. Like, <laughs> he's talking into a big ring light. Right, right. So, there's I'll a dog you begging for help. So, that one wasn't me. When he was in Boston during the parade, when he's harassing like some poor woman in front of a, a a restaurant i called the restaurant and said hey do you still have that guy there hey, here's some information you might want in case the police are like not really caring and it's probably not gonna be terribly useful but it maybe will help you in case you decide to pursue one of the many avenues open to you and she was very grateful that i gave her that information while he was still there um i just gotta ask lauren laguna something Honey, can you just get off the internet, go study for the bar and clean the house till the 15th? Because you need to do those things, just so that we're clear. Like, I work full time. I do this stream thing. Uh, contrary to what you believe, I do have kids that I'm raising here, and I can still figure out how to fucking clean my house. You can't work a part-time job and study for a test and figure out how to clean your house. Go. Do it. Thank you. That's we'll not nice. That's that's we'll compare chilly on the French. 15th. We'll, yeah, no, I'm sorry. I'm just look what you did, friend. Lauren. Look what you did. <laughs> right, right. Come on, Lauren. Seriously, that's Chili and Aiden's friend. Seven, and she's like, according to Chili, you got a rubber nose in it now. Lauren, I have heard that uh, Chili can help you study with the constitutional law portion of the exam. She she needs help. She's not studying. Like she's just on here all day calling people fat. <laughs> Think about the substance of who you are, because the. Uh, the bar certainly will. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. It's a fallacy. It's just a fallacy. <laughs> it's a fallacy. Yeah, when I sat for that exam, it was basically just like a, a spirit journey to discover who I was. Was, that was it? The test. You didn't study at all, though, right? No, I didn't. Nope. But it you just stayed on the internet all day and called people fat? Yes. Yeah, okay, good. Then My studying consisted board. exclusively of trash talking in the YouTube comment section. <laughs> right, right, right. Huh. That's the dream. I hear it's like 95% of the test. 
Oh man. So are you sad about the end of your YouTube channel, Blue? I am. Oh yeah. I'm like, whoo, like, is there a plot for me to like just lie down and do I have to dig my own grave? Uh, You're next to me. You like, have to fundraise for it. So Yeah. How much tombstone tombstones are expensive? Yeah, we're gonna have to do a fundraise for oh, my yeah, tombstone. Yeah. On Friday, I think. <laughs> you're, next to, you're next to me, Blue. It's it's me, uh, you, and then James. Oh, we got a family plot. Life. I'm in. All right. Now I'm excited. I would like to be next to Bow. Oh, okay. <laughs> the always wins twins. Yeah. When I was trying to put on my in Minnesota, I did help some clients get prepaid burial plans, so you can always investigate that. Oh, see, that's why we keep you around. Yeah. You know, yeah. Chili's gonna raise the money, and then after five thousand, the rest goes towards the funerals. <laughs> He's gonna handle it all. Well, he did say he was telling somebody uh, something along the lines of, "If you're doing a fundraiser, you should be making money off of that." Now, not in those words, but it certainly seemed to break down into that. Like you don't, you don't pers you shouldn't personally profit off of a fundraiser for something you're fundraising for. My my personal opinion. Yeah, I just, I just think that it's sad that this is how it has to end. Like, yeah. Know. Well, it was nice. It was a good run. It was a good run. It was a good run. It was. It was a valiant fight. Oh uh, well. Yeah. Yeah. Can we all just have a moment of silence for you know the end of this era? And uh, then we can kind of celebrate and look hopefully towards the future to the oh, uh, hold on. Chili de Castro. I got something. Okay, awesome. I hope it's amazing grace on the bagpipes. <laughs> so silent, so silent. All right. Given the rest of that. <laughs> oh man! I appreciate it. I I got a little misty eyed. I am. Now oh, we're back. Yes. I mean, it wasn't so dead. Yes. Um. So, hold on. I wanted to answer someone. Pick up the laundry at the bathroom floor. I'd appreciate it if, in the last moments, that was done. If someone could come get my laundry off the bathroom floor. Um, Mars wants to know how much I ran for the secret, uh, how much I raised for the secret, uh, billboard fundraiser, $25, Mars. It was $25 even <laughs> shout out to the two people that, uh, trusted us blind enough to just dump a combined total of $25 into a fund for what they didn't know. Um, I think actually AFA was more successful in raising money for a billboard. I think he actually is doing a chili billboard. Um, I wanted to do, I believe at the time it was a, was it furry potato? I, I can't remember who it was that we we're going to do a billboard for, but I didn't want them to let, uh, I didn't want to let them know that we were doing a billboard. So I didn't say anything, uh, which was my folly because when Abrams just announced that he was doing a billboard, he was able to fund it in like a day. So. And I am the Mars Life's future ex-wife. I love him very much. Cyrax is going to be very hurt. He had his chance. He had his chance. Well, I guess we'll read some, we'll read some super chats so we can profit off Chili's name one last time. This is it. We are not going to come back with a deep dive into Jeffrey Sutton's horrifying family history. We're not. We would never do that. We can't. We're dead now. Uh, Kira, 808 State, became a YouTube member. Thank you for joining right as this ship is just sinking like the Titanic. Um, Sally and Dakao, gosh. Leave my son alone. I, I, listen, thank you for the 999. I don't know anything about his mother. Um, Taco and Yoshi Gaming joined. Thank you. Nemo, $10 for the wake fund. I appreciate it. We'll probably just spell, spend it on drugs, though. Uh, Barry G four ninety nine sitting Shiva right now, sad face. I don't know what that means. 
G Rob, two dollars. Don't give up, Kate. I have to. I'm defeated. Look at. I mean, you guys see Lauren Laguna in the chat. Uh, how could anybody like even presume to step to that? Like, she just comes in here and she's so smart and so charming and so kind and empathetic. So I'm no match. And and thin and pretty and successful too. Oh, don't forget that. Uh, Tracker seventy. Thank you for joining the sinking ship. All bud, no seeds, 420. Quit blocking me, Kate. It was not me. No, that was totally me, and it was completely an accident. I'm so sorry. I tried. I immediately messaged Kate. It's because we keep starring the comments at the same time. We have a I know. <laughs> sorry. All bud, no seeds, 420. Um, like the name, by the way. Akira 808 say, is state 499. This really sucks. Just don't give up, Kate. Guys, obviously, we're not really shutting down the, the channel. It's just... Thank you for your concern, but we're obviously just mocking Chili right now. Uh, cue the See You at the Crossroads song. Yeah, I'm probably going to play a song at the end of this, and if it gets de uh, demonetized or uh, taken down, uh, we'll see. Kate just got a blank federal lawsuit on indestructible paper, and you can all add your own details. Yes. Yes. Uh, I only dropped my son, Chili, accidentally on his head once. The other 10 times were on purpose, I'm guessing. Um, Josh, tell God to read poster seven and he will let you in. Yeah, probably. N nothing is getting Josh Abrams into heaven. Let's be fair. Um, Chili wouldn't share his ice cream with Josh. Yeah, I really had hopes for them as a power couple. And it's just not going to happen now. That was our first, like, real hit of grief was that breakup, you know? I really, I, when I saw them first coming together, honestly, I was, like, really excited um, to, uh, to see where that was going to go because I figured that it was going to be really entertaining. Never in a million years did I uh, think that it would turn out the way that it did. Hold on. I'm, I have a song I want to play at the end. I'm just checking the... Uh... All right. Yeah. So I can play the song at the end of it. All right. Good. All right. Jeff Lloyd. If anyone sees Chili, can you ask him to bring back my all my Viagra? Thanks. Yes. I'll call him later and ask Jeff. Jeff fucking Lloyd, everyone. Totally straight. Um, just get yeeted from Chili because Blue Bacon is on the phone with him. I was praising Blue Bacon. Nobody praised Blue Bacon. Come on. How dare you? Don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. Don't do it. Uh, Nancy Holier or Hollier for $5. I love your show. Finally get to catch a live. I would like to get in touch with you. Yeah, if you want to get in touch with us right here, look at this. Info at massholereport.com. You can email us. Somebody told us today that we were pieces of shit on the email. It was really nice to get. I enjoy those emails, too. It was uh, a love letter. Uh, yeah, I get a lot of them. Uh, G Rob, I send prayers to y'all. Chili shows no mercy, unfortunately. He doesn't. He is a relentless enemy. Jeff Lloyd, $9.99. Cell coverage was great at the glory hole. I met Chilean. <laughs> was it? Was it Jeff Lloyd? <laughs> Jeff Lloyd for $9.99. Mm. You have to Chili do a creepy one. You have to go. Mm. Mm. Chili taking control. <laughs> Chloe for 1999. Oh my god, if Blue Bacon comes on the live stream with Kate, I'm literally gonna get so wet I will slide off the couch. JK, love your streams, Kate. Ooh. How's the floor? Ooh. You really you got the ladies going here, Blue Bacon. Yeah. International sex. Well, no, there's so I appeal to an older audience, which I'm fine with. The problem well. To a degree, that's kind of a good thing because the likelihood of depends uh, is higher. So if you have that issue, uh, you're welcome. You know, glad you could find me at this point in your life. But uh, <laughs> I appreciate the flattery. Hey, hey, Blue Bacon, will you go out to coffee with me and Chili sometime? Uh, you're going to have to bring it to the grave. But, you know, I could, you know, I guess he's poor. No, we can get it popping at the headstone. Let's yeah. go. Let's, let's go a little bit of rape. Hopefully not with Let's Chili's actual egg. popping team. Oh. <laughs> Everybody, Chuck Steggle is in the house. What's up, Chuck Steggle? Thank you for the dollar, man. That was You never have to do that, Chuck Steggle. That is particularly generous coming from you. Chuck Steggle, everyone. Chuck Steggle. Chuck Steggle. Blue Bear, $20 just to piss Chili off because Kate always wins. Right now, I think it's on to... Uh, uh, skeptic always wins. Bow always wins. Or I believe we should probably start. Blue always wins. I, 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 you know, not always. Sometimes I, you know, have my my errors. But 
I do pretty all right. Also, I'd like to apologize to some of the women in the chat. Some of them are like, um, I'm young. I, I just meant in general, not all of you. You guys Those are great. are all old spinsters. <laughs> you told me before the show. That's, that's how I keep myself from being paths. tempted. You know, otherwise I, I may, maybe I'll stray from the, the good and righteous path. Nima 19079 $20. Applause to you who called the gas station at. Whoever did that, reach out. I just want to know. Like we want to give you some credit. Sarah Marie for five pounds. He's a grown man in his late forties, living in his car, begging for people to crowdsource his way across the USA. Everyone who gives a dollar is scammed. Yeah, no, I mean, definitely. Definitely. What if he's just pioneering the crowdsource lifestyle? The, the crowdsource lifestyle? Oh, yeah. Make everyone pay for your, I mean, it's not just influencing. Yeah, that's been happening in general. Forever. I feel like you could just do that openly. What's up, guys? I'm doing my influencer challenge where I'm not actually influencing something, but still trying to live the lifestyle. Come on. That that would make actually a pretty fun channel. Right. Fuel up my van, and I'll sit at the pump. The gas station manager over there at the Phillips 66 uh, for $19.99 is asking, can somebody please get this fool out of our gas pump area? We tried. <laughs> somebody tried. It didn't work. They tried for you. Mad Cheddar just gave us Mad Cheddar four ninety nine. Thanks, bro. We're probably just gonna spend it on drugs. Uh, Ed two two seven six. Kate, I plagiarized. I mean, wrote your eulogy. It's in your email. Would you please read it before the end of the stream? Yes, Ed. I'll do that right now. Actually, all right. Here we go. I mean, he got a shark from asshole. So we're gonna download this and we're gonna open it. He did. Oh, he, he, he bought me a shark. All right, ready. Friends, massholes, countrymen, lend me your ears. I come to bury Kate, not to praise her. <laughs> the evil that women do lives after them. The good is often turred within their bones. So let it be with Kate. The noble Chile hath told you Kate was ambitious. If it were so, it was a grievous fault. And grievously hath Kate answered it. Here, under leave of Chile and the rest... For Chile is an honorable man. So are they all who support Chile. All honorable men. Come I to speak at Kate's funeral. She was my friend, faithful and just to me. But Chile says she was ambitious and Chile is an honorable man. Kate hath brought many frauditors to account whose e-bags did the super chats fill. Did this in Kate seem ambitious? When the poor have cried, Kate hath wept. Ambition should be made of sterner stuff. Yet Chile says Kate was ambitious, and Chile is an honorable man. You all did see once that on the looper cow, I thrice presented Kate a queenly crown, which she did thrice refuse. Was this ambition? It took a judge to proclaim Kate queen of the trolls before she would relent and accept the honorific. Yet Chile says she was ambitious. And sure, Chile is an honorable man. I speak not to disprove what Chile spoke, but here I am to speak what I do know. You all did love Kate once, not without cause. What cause withhold you then to mourn for her? Oh, judgment, thou art fled to brutish beasts and men have lost their reason. Bear with me. My heart is in the coffin there with Kate. And I must pause till it come back to me. Thank you, Ed, That's, that was beautiful. Very beautiful. Um, and I agree. I'm probably the least ambitious person I know. Very lazy. And Chili is very honorable. Very honorable. Yeah, yeah. And Shakespeare's estate will probably send you a bill for that one. Mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And my delivery did absolutely no justice. But thank you for that. Does Shakespeare even have an estate, really? No. Uh, no. I, <laughs> also, fair use. Uh, Pat's Cats, four ninety nine. R.I.P. Yes. Gur and Akiva the Great, uh, $2. Can we vote on whether we want a Lauren debate? I mean, it's kind of compulsory. She's very important, and she demands the attention, and she is entitled to it. Sorry. Uh, Michael Bowman, $25. Blocked by Chili Short, sold out. Damn it, he keeps asking me to take a picture or stream in this blocked by chili sh sh shirt, and I keep forgetting, Mike. I'm so sorry, guys. Everybody, email me at info at massholereport.com. I'm asking for your help. Remind me 
that I need to stream in my blocked by chili shirt. I'll remind you. Well, I'm I might need to buy one of those. They're great. They're sold out. I'll get you one somehow. I'll, I'll finagle a beagle. Yeah, I, I got my sources. I got some people with baseball bats. I can, uh, you know, travel around and do things. Goddess of Truth for $5. Kate, please reach out to me on Discord. I have something important I would like to talk to you about. Thank you. Absolutely, we'll do that. Uh, Grendel S. Rage, thank you for joining this sinking ship. Who cares? Four ninety nine. dollars Love you, Kate. Love you, too. Thank you. Uh, Art. Art Akuto. Defund. Delete laws. I, I think that's what's happening right now, and he seems upset about it. Uh Joe, Joel or Joel? I'm sorry. Any luck on obtaining the court transcript? I am still going back and forth with the clerk's office, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, there are actually a couple agencies that I am currently uh, probably going to have to file a complaint with uh, with your attorney general's office to get those records. So it's been pretty annoying. Uh, but we just keep moving on here. And John Clark, Clark $5. Thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. Ah. Oh. Well, this has been a really emotional day. And to address Alana Hader's comment, uh, you are certainly welcome to sue for the emotional damages for the loss of mass hole, but uh, that actually brings up a better point. Uh, now that Chili has summarily eliminated Kate and Blue and everybody else who he's going after, uh, that opens up him, or that opens mm -hmm. him up to each and every one of their viewers to sue him for wrongful death. So... And my estate might have to sue him for loss of revenue. There you go. Class action wrongful death lawsuit. We get to see how much better I am at filing that than he is. Breaking, breaking legal ground right there. Uh, did I take acting lessons from Chili? No. No, Chili's probably a better actor than I am, honestly. Uh, Chili is the Amber Heard of YouTube. <laughs> he acts like he knows law. Please do a debate with Lauren as a lawyer in Arizona. I would love to join. Absolutely, AZ Jeep girl. Shoot us an email. It'd be great. Good times. Does anyone else have any thoughts? I'm sweating over here. I need to turn my air conditioner back on in a minute. No? Just got somber in here. Yeah, we're morning, dude. Yeah, it's been a rough night. Yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. like I don't like funerals. Just sad sure that all these channels died. You know, Chili's such an alpha. He just took down so many YouTube channels in one day. Like, it's just crazy. One fell swoop, really, yeah. Yeah. He's like Thanos of YouTube. Yes, he has snapped yeah. his butthole fingers and done. Yeah. No. Yeah. So I guess, uh, you know, we will not be coming back later in the week uh, to discuss Jeffrey Sutton, the... Uh, Independent First Definitely Amendment not. auditors, uh, disturbing family history. We, we will not be doing that at all because we're done here. It's over. Blue Bacon accidentally exited the call. Thanks for joining us, Blue Bacon. You just knew that it was over. Um, uh, this is my first YouTube dead stream. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is this is where we go to die is YouTube. Um, it's really sad. Uh, Grandma Sunshine Dragon says, Blue Bacon is handsome. You don't need to pay to say that, girl. Everybody knows that. Zombie stream Friday. Yes. Actually, Saturday. But Saturday will be a zombie stream. Yes, indeed it will. We'll be coming back. Uh, who is this Lauren person? It's a long story. It's a long story. She's just very important, very successful, thin, pretty, and super nice and uh, humble, too. Very humble, too. She may or may not have touched the penis of Martin Screlly and is actually proud of that. That, that could have happened as well. It did. It did happen. All right. So anyway, guys, I'm going to end the stream. I'm going to uh, turn on my AC, get the flock out of here, I think is what I'm supposed to say, and uh, go to bed. But we'll be we'll be back raising from the dead. There'll be a little resurrection. We just got to go chill in a cave for like three days. Okay. Good night. Thank you Rest in peace. Yeah, we're done.